Welcome to the TV5 Vault. I'm Chris Eastlick. Five years ago, Sam Merrill passed away suddenly, and each day we remember him by broadcasting our newscast from the Sam Merrill Memorial Studio. In today's edition of the TV5 Vault, we look back at what Sam's friends and colleagues had to say about his passing. Sam loved his hometown Pittsburgh Steelers, would frequently go home to watch games. One year they were in the Super Bowl, and Sam and I worked the newscast that followed the game. And when it got to the game, all the TV monitors back in the newsroom were very small. The biggest TV in the building, right here in the Weather Center. So we came out and we reworked some wires. No audio. Sam stood here the entire game watching his Pittsburgh Steelers. We could hear him in the newsroom. He was that passionate of a fan. Sam, I hope you have a good seat for the rest of the games. Sam was my buddy. He was one of my best friends ever. We go back a long way. I made him laugh. He made me laugh. We talk about TV5. We talk about life. It's all we did was laugh. He was that kind of guy. But today, I, I cry for him and his wife, Katie, and his son. Sam was just a beautiful guy, a beautiful person, and uh, you know him as being great on the air, and he was just as great off the air. Hey, dude, I love you. I'll always be thinking about you. He is mid-Michigan. He is TV5. He loved what he did. He cared about the people of mid-Michigan. It's a shock. Sam will be sorely missed. I pray for peace right now for his family and all of you. And I know he is a man of faith, and God is with him. God bless you all. Sam made me better at what I do. He was just unflappable. It didn't matter the the story that was being told or what was going on behind the scenes of trying to put together live TV, he was solid. He was solid all the time, and that gave me a confidence and a comfort in sitting next to him. And for that, I will, I will always be thankful. But where my heart is today is just with his wife, Katie, and his son, James. And Katie, I just hope that you know how much he loved you and that when we would be talking in commercial breaks about our families, he just lit up every time he talked about you. And I hope that you know that in the depth of your soul is how much he loved you and how proud, how so very proud he was of James. That's what I remember most about Sam. You were his source of happiness. And I hope that brings you a peace and a comfort in the days ahead. And just, just know that I'm praying for you. And a guy we miss very much every single day. If you have a favorite memory of Sam, please comment below. And thanks again for joining us for this edition of the TV5 Vault. I'm Chris Hazelick.